The development of the Becker Mewis duct started in 2007. The goal was to create a hydrodynamic energy saving device for slower and full form vessels, which is going to be better than any other. After analyzing the already established devices, two principles for an improved device were concluded. First, it must earn a profit of different losses. Second, it should not contain any rotating parts. I combined a pre-swirl fin which reduces the vortex losses of the propeller, which has been known for already 100 years, with a nozzle known for already 50 years that reduces wake field losses. Both components result in a power saving up to 4%, which can be increased to 8% through a successful combination. After a brief development phase that followed using CFD calculations, it was proven that the combination of these two components was successful and can be visible on the model and full scale. The following points are the most important effects of the MD. First, power savings up to 8%. In relation to that, harmful emissions are also reduced. Second, propeller pressure impulses are significantly reduced. Due to that, there is a very noticeable reduction of vibrations on the ship. Third, core stability of the coarse instable ships is significantly improved. Because of that, there's an additional power saving since the ship is going in a straight direction. Fourth, the reduction of RPM due to becker mewis duct adds up to approximately only 1%. For that reason, the duct is also suitable for upgrading, which distinguishes it from all other devices. If I consider all the main characteristics, I am strongly convinced that we developed a device that is indeed better than all the other devices. Lisnave Dry Dock The arrival of one more tanker into the dockyard for a class inspection. Nautilus, owned by a Greek shipping company Delta Tankers, is a 163,000 DWT tanker with ice class 1A. With a service speed of 14.5 knots and a daily fuel consumption of 74 tons, this vessel is operating worldwide. Harbour tugboat is pulling one Suez Max tanker to the dry dock from the Portuguese dockyard Lisnave. Exact positioning during docking is very important to avoid any damages to the ship. Strong winches are helping to bring the ship into the correct position. Once the ship is positioned, the door of the dock closes and the water from the dock is pumped out. Immediately after the docking the work begins. The ship has to be washed and the aft ship is to be staged so that the propeller can be dismounted. The shipping company decided to use the usual five years class inspection in order to install the Becker Mewis duct. The Becker Mewis duct is delivered in two parts and is assembled in the dockyard. Since the duct is made of steel structure, it can be put together and installed in every dockyard worldwide. Right after the assembling, the duct is coated with two primer layers. After a short time, the Becker Mavis duct is attached behind the ship. A BMS service engineer is discussing all necessary steps in order to assure a smooth installation. 
the superintendent in charge is informed about the complete process. Cooperation between the service engineer, shipyard and the class inspector is of a great importance since every Becker Mavis duct is installed in accordance to the class requirements. Once the approximate position has been achieved, the dockyard immediately starts with the staging so that a safe entrance to every area of the duct is assured. In order to be able to move the Becker Mavis duct forward, a lifting eye and a chain block are installed on both sides. Through the plumb line and some markings, it is very easy to determine exact position of the duct and to control it during the installation. Once the height and the center line position is ok, the fin system is cut to the appropriate length. The shipbuilder fits the fin system and pulls the duct to the front in order to put it in the correct position. The BMS service engineer is present in order to supervise and to support the dockyard with his experience. Once the final position is reached and all the weld preparations are done, the welding begins. After the welding, all the joints will be examined at the dockyard through a damage-free test. Therefore, the classification inspector is also present. The propeller is installed while the welded joints are cooling. All the mounting opening are sealed shut. After five days all the work is complete and the vessel is equipped with the Becker Mavis duct. From now on, the ship will consume 6% less fuel and therefore produce less damage to our environment.